we got a special edition of Becoming Fearless coming up. I got interviewed by the Ebony Empress out of uh, London. She had me on her award-winning uh, radio show. I didn't know exactly what was going to happen. I know I got surprised when I got on the show and she started talking about the 10 ways that we can get men to man up. I think by being that spontaneous and being kind of surprised, we were able to uh, truly come up with some really good material and it made for an extra fun show and an extra special show. To truly be confident, to really reach that depth of confidence, you have to be confident, not just with your actions, but with emotions. I knew a guy that was a Navy SEAL and he said, I could, I could take, you could take the Navy SEALs and you could say, run to the top of that hill and, and you know, take that guy with the machine gun, do all this stuff, and we'll do it. But go talk to that pretty girl at the bar. And a lot of some of these guys will still be scared. And I, I thought a lot about that. And I, I thought, well, there's more than one type of confidence. One is like a physical and running into danger. And I think men are built for that. We kind of love it. Um, and that's your typical confident man. I'm going to run into the burning building and save people. But then there's the other type, which is emotional confidence. This ability to step into emotion, and sometimes it's like a, a lot of emotion, somebody mad at you, somebody upset, and stay solid in the emotion and actually connect to that other person. And uh, we're really working on helping guys develop both. They're weak on either side. But I think the larger part of our job is helping men be confident in a masculine way with their vulnerability. And in that, they can develop real connections with real people. You know who David Date is? No, I don't. No. He's a really good author. He wrote a, a book for men called The Way of the Superior Man. It's about becoming a more powerful man. And in that book, he describes the, the first stage man. It's my way or the highway. Get out. You know, it's like it's the biker. You know, so I'm going to do what I want. And uh, second stage man is compromise. Like, nice guy. Uh, what do you need? But but all the passion and polarity in relationship goes away because he's just trying to please all the time. What do you want? Let me do this for you. Well, I'll just make her happy and, and everything will be good. And the third stage man, he says, I'm going to feel into you so deep that I'm going to feel your emotions and almost know what you need before you do. And that's kind of one of David Davis' descriptions is teaching a guy to be able to feel into his partner that deeply to really connect with her on that deep level. And that's a large part of the work. They have to be shown at first. I mean, I don't think they know it's possible. If you're enjoying this preview of Becoming Fearless, make sure to check out the whole episode. Enjoy the rest of your week. And remember, only the confident live.